and welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I do a purely preschool lesson with my toddler. I am so excited about today's video because this is a huge collab hosted by Yasmin from Mommy on the Move, where she has gathered together a whole bunch of YouTube moms showing you guys how they do a lesson from the purely preschool curriculum. So in my description box below, I will have the entire playlist of all of the other homeschooling moms doing a lesson from purely preschool. You will find there are moms that are doing the lessons in the Spanish version and the English. So I am very excited to be a part of this collab. This purely preschool curriculum was actually made by a fellow YouTuber, Rachel from Seven and All. Her and her family built together these beautiful units that is definitely literature based and well appropriate for a toddler. I am very excited to continue using the purely preschool within my homeschool and I'm so excited for you guys to watch me do a lesson with my toddler. Now, Rachel from Seven and Awk, the creator of Purely Preschool, was so gracious to offer a giveaway in conjunction with this collab where she is going to be giving away $20 for any one of you guys who is the winner to be able to go on her website to um, purchase some of her curriculum. Now $20 doesn't seem like a lot, but for her shop it really is because each one of her purely preschool units is only $4.99. And honestly, I feel like it's more than a steal, especially for what you are getting within her preschool curriculum. I have been so excited doing this insect unit, especially because my daughter Leia has been really into bugs and insects. However, I'm very excited throughout our year to continue to use all the other units for Leia for preschool. So you guys go ahead and stay tuned while you watch me do a lesson with my daughter Leia from the Purely Preschool. Okay, you guys, before we get into today's lesson, I just wanna give you a quick flip through and show you how simple this Purely Preschool curriculum really is. So I have the Purely Preschool Insects Unit and I am so excited about it. Here is the table of contents that just goes over all of the insects we're gonna be doing within this unit. She has a welcome pack that just shows you what is included in each lesson, which is a story time, talk about it, alphabet, early math, let's play, music and poetry, science, social studies, motor skill, life skill, health and safety, and if you so choose, you can do a Bible verse along with the curriculum. She has a weekly schedule that you can use. However, she puts a huge disclaimer that it is a sample schedule and just use it to how whatever best suits you and for your family. She has a book list showing you the books that you're gonna be using for each of the insects in my case. And also to you guys, within the lesson, she does have the links to a YouTube video where they have a read aloud if you don't have an opportunity to use your local library to get the books you need for each unit. So I am so excited about today because I'm going to be doing the butterfly unit and Leia is gonna be so excited about this. So I went ahead and I already laminated my um, science and or my science and health and safety card because little hands tend to tear and I really want to make sure these stay intact for the whole week we're going to be talking about butterflies I have our um, butterfly alphabet pieces where Leia is going to be matching them and we can go over the letter sounds uppercase lowercase and also too I have my picture of the butterfly that we're going to be cutting out and painting and just having a whole lot of fun with it so I went ahead and I picked out some of my animal flashcards that I already had at home just to further show um, Leia just the butterfly, the caterpillar, how the caterpillar does go into a metamorphosis to become a butterfly, just giving her some more cues. And then I have my Very Hungry Caterpillar book for this butterfly unit. Okay, you guys, I have my two toddlers here. I have Leia, who's in the far uh, right. She's in the purple. Um, she is three, and then this is Alana, she is one. So I am about to start our purely preschool, and the first thing I like to do is I like to start off with the reading. We are actually doing the butterfly unit, and the reading for the butterfly unit is The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Are you excited? Butterfly. Yes, we're talking about the butterfly. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> so I like to read to them while they... Okay, okay. She wants me to read to them, but um, here you go, Lana. 
she's ready for me to read. So I like to read to them while they are eating. So while they're eating, I'm going to read to them the Very Hungry Caterpillar, and I'm going to do the two science and health cards to go along with the purely preschool activity. So let me go ahead and get right into these girls because they are waiting for mama. <laughs> okay, look, Leia, this book says The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Are you excited? In the light of the moon, we a little egg on the leaf. On Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and popped out of the egg came a very, very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. Yeah. On Tuesday, he ate through two Good job, and he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. You guys, this is my absolute favorite part of the day when I spend time reading with my daughters. And I love Purely Preschool just because it allows me to continue to read with them, but also have a lesson that I can incorporate with it. I am not that crafty when it comes to putting things together. However, I love how beautiful this curriculum is already put together for me, especially being a busy mama of three. And um, I'm really excited about Purely Preschool really just being in our home and being a part of our daily flow. And then he was a beautiful butterfly. Yes, a butterfly. He sure was. So Leia, caterpillars, they go through a metamorphosis to become butterflies. You want to see it? Caterpillars go through a metamorphosis to become butterflies. And eating too many, eating too many sweets is not good for our body. So we can't eat too many sweets, Lay, because it's not good for our body. Yeah. You want to see that one? Okay. Like it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we can't eat too many sweets because it's not good for our body. Okay? We got to eat nice, healthy foods like our breakfast today. <laughs> Okay, you guys, while the kids are still eating, I just wanna go ahead and show you my little morning basket that I put together for like our Purely Preschool. They do have two books that you do with each lesson. However, I just use whatever books I like. And um, <laughs> you're showing everyone everything. <laughs> so Leia, she really enjoyed the cheese. Okay. Cheese. Okay, Leia, she really enjoyed the science and health cards, you guys. But I really just wanna show you guys. Leia, one second. In my dress. Okay, yeah, they like your dress. Yes, they like your dress. They think dinosaur. it's beautiful. Yes, you have dinosaurs on your dress. <laughs> okay, sorry you guys. <laughs> okay, you guys, as you so seen, my daughters did not want me to speak in that clip. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what I have in my basket um, for our purely preschool. I have the Itsy Bitsy Spider book. I also have this other book, which is called My Very First Shapes from Eric Carl that I already have at home. I also have like, again, my animal flashcards. I do have the other animals in here from the other units we're going to be using. I have Leia's flashcards that I do use for Leia for letter recognition. And also to you guys, Leia has been working a lot on her letter sounds just because that's something that we do do for speech because Leia is in speech therapy. She does have a speech delay. If you guys kind of noticed in the clips before, she is doing really, really good. But um, I do want to continue to incorporate things for speech. I also have their Bible study lesson that I use. And instead of using the memory verse from the Pure preschool we are actually doing creation right now so it's really beautiful how I'm able to tie in the the purely preschool with this creation that we're doing in her Sabbath school lesson and we're talking about all the animals and the insects and things like that and she's really associating these two things and also too I'm not using the Bible verse from the purely preschool she is using the Bible verse from this lesson and um, yeah so they've been trying to memorize Genesis 1 verse 31 and she's been doing a really good job with that as well so this is my morning basket for my purely preschool for my toddlers Put your apron on because you're going to paint. 
that keeps your clothes nice and clean. You're welcome. Here, let's see. Let me tie the back. Yeah, you got your apron. So your dress, your dinosaur dress can stay nice and pretty. Okay, you ready? Yeah, we're gonna paint a butterfly. Yes, we're gonna paint a butterfly. Okay, now you have to tell mommy what colors you want. What colors do you want to paint your butterfly? Yellow. You want yellow? Okay. Here, let mommy put it in here, okay? Mm. All right, we're going to put yellow. Mm. You got yellow. Good job. What other color you want? Mm. Green. You want green? Okay, that's pretty colors. Yellow and green. For the arts and the crafts wish me well i went ahead and i cut out the butterfly we're going to be using i put some paint in uh leia's little paint tray and then for alana since she's younger i'm going to use the um do a dot markers with her so she can do it she's only one but i do like her to be involved in our uh, school as much as i can so yeah so you excited here we go uh oh there you go you gonna go ahead and paint it. Looks beautiful. Good job. Good job. Ooh. What color do you wanna do yours? I, I wanna put it right here. Don't mess it up here. Look. A few markers. Good job, right here. <laughs> right there. This is Lana's butterfly right here. <laughs> What does that say? Let's see. It says, eating too many sweets is not good for our bodies. <laughs> yes, eating too many sweets is not good for our bodies. <laughs> Where's the next one? What did you do with the other one? Where's our other cart? Oh, here it goes. Cart. What's that one say? Cart. Let's see. That one says caterpillars but. go through a metamorphosis to become butterflies. Yeah, yeah what's that right there, Leia, in the picture? That's a caterpillar. Yes, caterpillars go through a metamorphosis to become butterflies. Wow. Wow, I know, that's amazing. for 
watching today's video. I really hope you enjoy watching me do a purely preschool lesson with my toddler. You guys, I know this video got kind of crazy, but hopefully you still were able to see just pretty much how simple these lessons are, how it's all put together for you as the mom and it's nothing really you have to do. So you guys, please don't forget to check out all the other YouTube's mom's videos down below in the playlist in my description box. And please do not forget to go ahead and enter into the giveaway that Rachel is hosting. I will have all that information down below in my description box. So as always, you guys, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. I will see everybody in my next one. Bye.